Hello everyone, it's me again, Steed OJ here, back with some more Ultimate Tenkaichi. I almost keep saying free. Um, but that's not the case, this is just Ultimate Tenkaichi. Uh, last time I completely wrecked Piccolo, I'm gonna give myself absolute points for that. Um, I didn't really wreck him, he destroyed me for majority of the time until I got lucky and turned into a Super Saiyan. But that's besides the point. Um, if you guys want more Ultimate Tenkaichi, obviously please let me know by uh, leaving a like on the video. Don't forget to subscribe, it greatly supports the channel. As well as actually notifies you guys when I do upload these. Oh, that's where we're supposed to go, that yellow thing on the map. And leave a comment down below of what you would like to see next, alright? Yeah, cool. I'm thinking we're going to fight something Busaga next. Because first time it was Ginyu, which is very... What the f Fuck, that is an escalation. Okay. <laughs> I thought it was going to be Busaga next. No, we're fighting Great Ape Baby right now. Okay. He now knew where to find the Great Ape who defeated Piccolo. It's under the control of evil men. They're using the Savage Beast to rain terror down over the city. To save the people and to avenge Piccolo, the young warrior headed after the Great Ape. Okay, this is the Great Ape that beat up Piccolo. I was going to say Piccolo should be stronger than a Great Ape, but if it was this guy, then it makes absolute All sense. Right, you heavy monstrosity! Where are you? <laughs> I know you're around here! <laughs> Your custom character wants so much action. Perhaps everyone is hiding inside the buildings. <laughs> this should be fun! Show yourself, have you? I'm here to avenge Piccolo! Tell me who's responsible for ruining this world! Tell me and I'll spare your life! Oh, Jesus Christ! God damn! You have some nerve threatening me. You die here! Okay, so I'm assuming this is going to be like the first great boss battle, except with way more nonsense. Oh, he teleports. Okay. Oh, his blasts! Oh my, I still hate the recovery in this game. His blasts leave explosions behind, so... Should I even hit him with small key blasts? Because they take way too long to recover from. Oh boy, oh boy. Get out of the explosion, get out of the explosion, LPs! I, I'm not even joking, I stopped pressing the X button ages ago, and he still does the key blast. I think I'm just supposed to use charged key blast in them, because with charged key blast you recover way faster. With the X key blast you just stuck there. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. Oh! How the- How would I even know you- Okay, okay, thank you. Thank you so much that you swapped to a melee phase out of nowhere. Okay, so Grave Baby is definitely harder than the other Great Ape, but that's because of just look at look at this damage come on, and you get stuck in it. And I'm still gonna have to avoid the cutscene damage later, which is gonna just suck. Okay. Come on, shoot! Oh my lord. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by this twice. I don't have anywhere enough, like, near enough health to survive whatever's gonna happen in the cutscene. He just lamps off get mollywhopped. Oh. Ah! Sorry, great hip baby! Oh, he's dragging it! I, I hate, I hate, I hate the timing in this game so much. You have to press it so early, why? It's so weird. I don't know if that's the way this game was made or if that's what they actually intend. Or what do I have to do to break out this? You're looking quite pale. Oh, he said that in the anime, guys. It's too much. But I have to find out who my real enemy is. I'm gonna- am I gonna go soup, son? There we go. Oh yeah, you do- yeah, this is just the anime fight, except this time, uh, you take Goku's place. 
This is really just a recreation of the anime fight. Oh god damn it. Wait, wait. I'm I'm not even close enough to punch him. What? Oh what what is this? What the what what the fuck is this? What is this? What is this even? This is this is probably the hardest Dragon Ball boss so far of any Dragon Ball game ever. And I'm, this is only like the third enemy you're supposed to face. You fight Ginyu, then the androids, the androids are super easy. Ginyu is hard, the androids are super easy. Piccolo is ungodly hard. And then this guy is just like, what the hell is this? How is that fair? Bro, I can't even. I can't even! Look, and then you're just stuck forever! I don't I don't like I don't like this game's controls. This, this game's controls are fucking creepy. Oh, oh that's fair. That's fair. No, I'm still I'm still stuck in the animation by the way. You can't even- You can't even get a full combo on Move! Move! Oh my god. I love this game's controls. They're so good. So good. Okay. Um, I'm gonna have to accept that. Because if I use the light key blast, I'll get through this phase way quicker. But I'm gonna guarantee take damage every time. Because look at this recovery, it's disgusting! Why is it like that? Who made this game? I'm gonna find out who made this game. And I'm gonna do bad things to them. Because you have to use the heavy key blast, that's the only way you're to recover fast enough. But the damage you do is less than- Oh my god, I'm just gonna get stuck in the explosion and die now. Oh boy, okay. I've never really thought about it, but why does baby's armor actually change color from turning into a giant monkey? Please let that count. Oh my god, I'm just gonna fucking castrate myself at this point. I'm so glad he gives me like so many places to move. And doesn't deal like, you know, half a health one one accidental hit. Sometimes the charge key blast will just miss him, what the fuck? That's too annoying. Cause move! Move! Oh my god. Cause you don't wanna be close enough. You don't wanna be close enough to the point where you your words of fire breath will hit you. But you also don't want to be too far away and have your melee attacks miss. Like you can't even get a full combo on him and the last hit does so much damage. I think you're not supposed to fight back until he gets stunned. That's probably what you're supposed to do. Just keep running away until his beam combo ends. Right? Yeah, I think that's what you're supposed to do. Move! Okay. Yeah, that's how you're supposed to fight this guy. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy, time to take some extra damage. Oh boy, look at that. Can I block these? Please tell me I can block these because I'm actually getting real sick of this. Move, move. It actually does less damage to take the blast directly. You can't even block these. Why do they even give you a block in these uh, giant boss fights if it doesn't do anything? Okay, oh boy. Time to get hit by the fire breath again. Oh boy. Please actually let me avoid the fire breath. Please. Please let that count. Please. Oh my God. This is just. These, these controls actually suck. 
They are the worst controls ever. And to believe that that Battle of Z is actually worse than this one. My god. They went on a downhill streak of Dragon Ball games after Raging Blast. Straight up. Okay. God damn it, please. I'm gonna- No, you know what? I'm gonna fight him as safe as I possibly can. I'm gonna be timid. Alright. Berko, please give me all the power of uh, Tenakachi Berko. Lend me your energy. Let, tell me the secret art of how to be timid. No, 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 I was, oh, thank God. Okay. Because the timid meme is Berko's meme, so I need his power. He's the only one who knows how to be timid as well as defeat the timid. So, please, Mr. San Cole. Berko San. <laughs> San Cole. Please, 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 please. Oh my god. I'm literally allowed to shoot him twice. Um, for context, when I say shoot twice, I mean press the X button once. Because when you press it once, it makes you shoot two key blasts. When you press it a second time, it makes you shoot four. So. Now to take even more damage. Awesome. Now to take even more damage. Awesome. Oh, now to take even more. Okay. Because I got hit once, I lost half the health bar. This is actually the worst thing ever, like, period, in the history of the whole universe. Please! Please! Baby, have some mercy! Oh, thank God, thank God. Okay, please let me avoid the fire breath this time. I'm actually begging you. Yes! Oh my God. Oh, and I did it with such high health remaining. That means I can actually have a chance in the next, um, in the next phase. You're looking quite pale. It's too much. But I have to find out who my real enemy is. Yeah! Give me that hand. Uh, what is this? What? What? What is? How is that? Okay. What? You, what attack was that? Are you? You're still doing this? You're still doing this? Oh, come on, no! This is so dumb. I hate this. Okay, it seems like this finger black attack is actually all just one attack. Yeah, it's just all one attack. When he does it three times. Okay, how did that? How do I actually avoid this one? No, like that's not a joke. How do I avoid that? WHY IS THE EXPLOSION STILL THERE?! Okay. I think I'm supposed to go to the back of the stage that way it just goes off over the edge without hitting, um... Without hitting the center. That's what I'm supposed to do against that. Do it a third time. Oh! What is this? Oh! That's... No, that's fair. That's fair. So sometimes the third hit will just be a different super attack, I'm guessing. Cause I, oh, because I was at the front, that's probably why he used the explosion, right? Yeah, okay, the explosion only reaches the front. That's why he used it. And if I'm at the back, he'll use this, and I'm supposed to... Oh, it didn't even go over the edge this time. So how do you actually avoid that move? Sometimes it hits the stadium, sometimes it doesn't! What the fuck?! Let me move, please let me move. Oh my god. Next phase. What a Remember my training with Piccolo. Yes, do that. Become a Super Saiyan. And please give me health back too. What? 
Ah, there we go. I mean, I can't notice the difference in your hair, but your eyes are blue. What the? <laughs> I went through the trouble of becoming a Super Saiyan to at least entertain me a little. Jesus Christ, your custom character is cocky. Oh my god, I, I love that. I love that part in GT, so I love it here. God damn it. I don't care what people say. GT had some memorable moments, with baby at least. I didn't get my health back though. That's kind of annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Oh really? Oh, so beautiful. Are you? Wait, what? <laughs> what is wrong with my custom cat? He sees revenge that and goes, Utsukushi. Ah, ah, come on! Ah! Yes. Is that the end? That's the end. Ah, yes, you piece of shit. Your custom character is so OP. The second he becomes Super Saiyan, baby stands no chance. Is he dead? Tell me who's responsible for all this chaos. <laughs> all right. Are you really? You're just gonna tell me? Collect the seven dragon balls and summon the ultimate Shenron. He's the one who turned this world into paradise. How the fuck can he do that? Like, it should be physically impossible for Omega Shannon to summon a dragon. Because, you know, he is the dragon. Oh, then you just die? Oh, that, okay. Finally, the young Saiyan learned the name of the man who plunged the world into chaos. And he now has a mission. A man he must defeat. Um, also, I just realized, is that the real Vegeta? Or is that baby Vegeta, just with a different Vegeta's body? Because either way... I put Super Saiyan 4 Goku to shame in terms of power if I beat Great Ape Baby as a regular Super Saiyan. Why is your custom character- th That boss fight was retardedly difficult, by the way. But even with how hard the boss fight is, how is your custom character this goddamn strong in this game? The hero puts the Xenoverse custom character to absolute shame. He puts everyone in Xenoverse to shame, actually. You could probably beat the hell out of Beerus and Whis at the same time if you wanted to. Actually, wait, that used that was a mission in Zeno. Yes, I unlocked Goku as a master! Uh, fuck Nappa. I unlocked Goku and Vegeta as a master, and I can get the super cool abilities. Oh, that's so good. I love it. I love it. In fact, that baby fight was legit so long, I think I'm just gonna make it its own video. Alright, that will be the end of this session, mostly because Grave Baby in himself was so difficult. Um, that he ended up just being his own video. Is the same fight still there? Okay, he ended up being his own video, so Grey Baby is his own fight. I'm gonna train with Goku and Vegeta off screen, and then I'll do the next part because uh, I I haven't actually played this for that long. But I think Baby as himself is is a good enough video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and if you enjoyed, please leave a like on the video, subscribe if you like what you see, and if you want to see more content like this. And do not forget, leave a comment down below. Let me know uh, again what you guys want to see next. Because I'm probably just going to finish the hero mode on this game. Because it seems like a lot of people love it. So naturally it just makes sense. I will. And yeah. So just let me know what else you want to see. I'll see you all next time. Take care. Peace.